Bible reading time. As we get in the Lord's Word one more time today to see what He had to tell us. I know it's going to be great. It's going to be wonderful. Because it always is and it's the best food we can eat. It's the word of truth of our Savior. As He walked down here on earth among men. And made a way and point, opened up a way that we could go. That heaven could be our eternal home when this life is over. But before we get into this word. We want to go to him in prayer in another little short video. Then we get into God's word. Uh, because we don't want to take up too much time uh, on one video. Uh, for respect of others. So just join me in prayer in this next little video. And then we'll get into the word of God. My gracious Heavenly Father, it's again we come to you today, Lord, with a thankful heart to thank you one more time, Lord, for your love and for your mercy that you've had towards us and for your holy word. I pray, Lord, you reach down today and touch those, Lord, that's lost and undone. And I pray, Lord, today you give them another chance to be saved before it's too late. And I pray, Lord, that you I bless everyone and please listen to your videos all night and fill them Lord with your Holy Spirit let them know how real you are Lord deep down in their heart and soul and let them know Lord they're your child and they're sealed unto the day of redemption Lord and I pray oh Lord you continue to give us the words that we need to say Lord that will reach someone and I pray oh Lord Lord, your word today uh, will not return void, uh, but accomplish for you sent it tonight, uh, and give us the words uh, that we need to say, uh, that someone will hear and listen, uh, and uh, know how much they need you, uh, that we uh, can plant seed in them, uh, that will bring them to you, uh, and be saved before it's too late, uh, because we want them all to be uh, in heaven someday, uh, and I'll have to go down to that lake of fire, uh, these things we ask, uh, in a wonderful name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ and amen and amen and thank you Father for your love and for your mercy now today we're getting God's word one more time we're going to be looking in the 12th chapter of St. Luke's Gospel and so many people today out that's so greedy. My friend, it is terrible. It's like a raging storm. That's sweeping our land and our country. Pushing out those that are in need. And heaping up money to themselves. That one day will destroy them. But let me tell you right here, I'd rather have the Lord Jesus Christ as my Savior. And though I'm on my way to glory, then own all the riches of diamonds, silver, and gold that is in this earth today. But because my friend is very much more important. We going for for the sake of time again. We're going to begin reading. Chapter chapter twelve and verse number eleven is where we're going to begin tonight. Be for the sake of time. Now, if you got your King James Version Bible, you can read along with me. You can go back to the first and read up and catch up with me and go through this with me 
But now listen, see what he said today. And my friend, what he said then, he's still saying it to us today. Uh, if we'll believe it, and if we take it to our heart, uh, and act upon it. Uh, and my friend, it's time uh, that people quit trying to play church, uh, and get get down to the down where the rubber meets the road is saying, uh, and serve a true and living God uh, according to his word. Now listen what he begins to say in number verse, verse 11. And when they bring unto, you, unto the sin of God and to magistrates and powers take you no thought how or what thing ye shall answer or what ye shall say. For the Holy Ghost shall teach you in the same hour what ye ought to say. My friend, this takes away uh, and tells us we don't have to write uh, uh, down our messages uh, at home before we can take them uh, to Sunday school, uh, to Sunday meeting, uh, and preach on them or Sunday night. Uh, my friend, the message is already uh, uh, written down in God's holy word, uh, this good old King James Version Bible uh, that I have in my hand tonight. Uh, uh, every my friend uh, is full of messages, God's message uh, from beginning to to the end, uh, and we don't have to search for messages uh, because they're already there. Uh, we don't have to order them from the internet uh, or someone else. Uh, we don't have to sit at home and write them down uh, before we get there because when we get there, uh, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, uh, to bring his message, uh, he'll give it to us that very same hour uh, uh, for what is needed uh, uh, for that day uh, and for that hour. And when off the company, I, I said unto him, Master, speak to my brother, uh, that he divide his, the inheritance with me. Uh, now here's where the greed begins to come in, uh, my friend, my friend. Uh, and he said unto him, uh, Man who made me a judge, uh, or a divider over you. Uh, and he said unto them, uh, Take heed and beware of covenants. Uh, uh, what is a covenant? Uh, greedy, my friend. Uh, I wish you for everything else. Uh, at someone that has uh, to make us live better, cause us to help us to live better. Uh, uh, my friend, my friend, uh, I desire everything and every other man's God. Uh, I bring it, take it for them and bring it to themselves uh, that they could have a better life. Uh, my friend, my friend, uh, I listen to God's word and what he says uh, and we'll learn a thing or two. Uh, and he said unto them, Take heed and beware of the covetous uh, of a man's life consensus, uh, not in the abundance of things which he possesses. Uh, and he spake a parable unto them, saying, uh, The ground of a certain rich man uh, I brought forth it plentifully. Uh, and he thought uh, within himself, saying, What shall I do? Uh, because I have no room uh, where to bestow my fruits. Uh, my pretty year, uh, he would begin to make plans. Uh, uh, what he is going to do? Uh, because he was so enthused. Uh, uh, with his riches, he had got uh, uh, so much great crops he grow that year. Uh, my pretty he didn't think uh, about the ones around him, uh, his neighbors that might be in need. Uh, my friend, he thought of himself only. Uh, I my friend, uh, and we see it all around us today, uh, happy today, uh, as it did here. Uh, I my friend, my friend, uh, again I say, wake up uh, to the truth of God's word uh, and listen what He has to say, uh, and rejoice and give God praise and glory. Uh, if you know your name is written down uh, in glory land, uh, and my friend, if it's written down uh, in glory land, uh, then the end, uh, my friend, uh, that's where our riches are going to be uh, uh, when we leave this world. Uh, uh, then we can go uh, to be with them uh, uh, forevermore uh, in that city called heaven. Uh, my friend, my friend, uh, if we build our faith, uh, hope on our riches uh, uh, down here, uh, one day many uh, is going to wake up in hell uh, uh, because they let the riches come between them uh, and the fellow man. Uh, but more than that, between them and God, uh, because God loves his children. Uh, my friend, and uh, uh, he, he called every one of us uh, to help each other out uh, in pinches uh, and troubles and trials uh, that we go through uh, and in needs that we have uh, that comes along.
Verse 17 again, and he thought within himself, saying, What shall I do? Because I have no room, I were to bestow my fruits. And he said, This will I do. This is where he began to make his plans. My friend, my friend, this... This will I do. I will pull down my barns and build greater, and there will I bestow all my fruits and my goods. Again, he didn't think of his neighbor. He didn't think of the one that was hungry. He didn't think of the one that was in need. My friend, my friend, but only of himself. My friend, does that remind us of anyone today that we know? My friend, my friend, I take close thought to God's word and listen to what he says like I've already said and then we will learn something I from his words and he said and I will say to my verse 19 and I will say to my soul so thou hast much good laid up for many years take that ease eat drink and be merry in other words don't worry about no one else my friend just, uh, my friend himself, uh, my friend, my friend, uh, it will not pay off uh, because that reward is coming uh, at the end of the way. Uh, they, it won't be good. Uh, just think of the rich man, uh, uh, Lazarus, uh, uh, where the rich man waked up. Uh, my friend, my friend, uh, that is colluded to all rich men. Uh, they put their money uh, between them and God. Uh, let the money be their God. Uh, and don't care nothing about the fellow man. Man, the one Jesus died I far on the Crabber's cross and saved them and gave his precious blood for them on the old rugged cross my friend But God said unto you, now listen, my friend, my friend, uh, what the Lord said uh, about this man, uh, my friend, my friend, uh, again I say, wake up, wake up, uh, uh, to what the word uh, had to say to us tonight, uh, and my friend implied uh, to our hearts and lives, uh, and know what Jesus said, uh, uh, my friend, my friend, uh, glorify him, uh, if you know your name uh, is written down in glory, but God said unto him, Thou fool this night, thy soul shall be required of thee, then who shall those things be which thou hast provided? So is he that layeth up treasure for himself, and is not rich towards God, my friend, my friend. That's why I said a while ago, I drew their help, my salvation, and know that I am, I should ensure uh, of my heavenly home uh, and that great reward uh, waiting at the end of our journey uh, and my treasure up there uh, that on all the world uh, and ever all the riches in it uh, because all the riches in this world uh, will perish uh, and burn up one day while well, after a while uh, and we'll be gone forever uh, and we won't need it uh, to the place uh, uh, we'll be going uh, my friend my friend uh, and listen to what he said and he said unto his disciples, Therefore I say unto you, Take no thought for your life, what ye shall eat, neither for the body what ye shall put on. The life is more than meat, and the body is more than raiment. My friend again, he said right here, to take not thought, no thought of your life. Huh? And when he speak, and he said unto his disciples, huh? my friend today, huh? if we're saved by the grace of God, huh? and following his word today, huh? and his teaching, huh? we are also disciples, huh? that's down here today, huh? I deliver this word and message huh? to others, huh? and to the lost and dying world, huh? my friend, my friend, huh? now listen to what he said, huh? The twenty-three, the life uh, is more than meat, uh, and the body is more than raiment. Uh, consider the ravens, uh, for they neither sow nor nor reap, uh, which neither have storehouse uh, nor barn, uh, and God feedeth them. Uh, how much more are ye uh, better than the fowls, uh, and which of you uh, with with 
thinking thought can add uh, to his stature. Uh, one cubit of the words. Uh, how, how many of us uh, can make ourselves grow uh, any taller than what we are? Uh, my friend, uh, uh, when we reach a height that God wants to be, uh, how can we make ourselves any higher? Uh, we cannot, my friend. Uh, although we put on high heel boots uh, and shoes, my friend, uh, the body length is the same. Uh, my friend, my friend, uh, you can't add to it. Uh, my friend, my friend, uh, because it's not made that way. Uh, my friend, my friend, uh, I listen to God's word again, uh, as I say, uh, and take it to heart uh, what he tells us. Verse 26, uh, If ye then be not uh, able to do that thing which is least, uh, why take your thought uh, uh, for the rest? Uh, if ye can't do this, uh, if you can't add a cubit to your stature, uh, to your height, uh, my friend, how why uh, take thought against the rest? Uh, because we are all uh, in the hands of a just and living God, uh, and he made us like he wants us to be. Uh, my friend, male and female, uh, now listen, uh, consider these lilies, uh, how they grow and grow, uh, they toil not, uh, they spin not, uh, and yet I say unto you, uh, that Solomon in all his glory uh, was not arrayed uh, like one of these, uh, if then God be clothed, if, the, if then God so clothed the grass, uh, which is today, uh, and in day in the field, uh, and tomorrow is cast into the oven, uh, how much more will he clothe you, uh, O ye of little faith, uh, my friend, my friend, uh, if we got faith, uh, my friend, that God would take care of us, uh, then we're not going to go crazy uh, over the riches of this world, uh, the things that we destroy. Uh, I know all of us uh, like to have good things and not things uh, in our houses and clothes to wear, uh, but by my friend, my friend, uh, there's nothing wrong with that, uh, but my friend, when you take it so greedy, uh, uh, that we'll steal, uh, uh, we'll kill and destroy, uh, do anything we can uh, to, keep, to keep from helping those in need, uh, and reply to ourselves, uh, and not think of someone else, uh, uh, then we were in the same place, uh, in the same order uh, that the rich man was, uh, because it'd be uh, uh, worse than more of the riches. Uh, thinking of our riches more than the one uh, our brothers and sisters in Christ uh, are whoever in need uh, than themselves. Twenty-eight, if then God so clothed the grass, uh, which is today in the field, uh, and tomorrow is cast uh, into the oven, uh, oh, ha oh, my, of and how much more uh, will he clothe you, uh, O ye of little faith, uh, and seek not ye uh, what ye shall eat, uh, or what ye shall drink, uh, neither be ye of a doubtful mind, uh, but believe, my friend, uh, don't doubt, but believe, uh, God will provide, uh, and he will, uh, for all these things, uh, do the nations of the world seek after, uh, and your father knoweth, uh, that ye have need of these things, uh, but rather seek ye the kingdom of God, uh, and all these things shall uh, be added unto you. Uh, fear not, little flock, uh, for it is your Father's good pleasure uh, to give you the kingdom. Uh, I sell uh, that is that ye have, uh, and give alms, uh, provide for yourselves bags, uh, which wax not old, uh, a treasure in the heavens, uh, that faileth not, uh, uh, where neither moth corrupt, uh, ne for where your treasures is, uh, there will your heart be also. Uh, let your loins be girded about, uh, and your light burning, uh, and ye yourselves like uh, unto uh, men uh, that wait for their Lord, uh, uh, when he will return, uh, uh, from the wedding, uh, that when he cometh, uh, and knocketh they, uh, uh, may open unto him immediately, uh, blessed are those servants, uh, whom the Lord, when he comes, uh, shall find watching, uh, verily, verily, ver uh, verily I say unto you, uh, that he shall gird uh, himself and make them uh, to sit down to me, uh, and will come forth and serve them. Uh, and if he shall come uh, uh, to the 
second watch, I are coming to the third watch, I and find them so blessed are those servants, I my friend, he will feed us, I my friend, my friend, I, that's where we're going to sit down, I at the marriage supper of the Lamb, I, I that's where we and I, I we get home, I that's when he takes all the power, I, I he's God, my friend, I, and turns it back over to the Father, I and he will serve us, I my friend, my friend, I have made it longing for that day, I, and if we are longing for that day, I, let's seek to please him, I, and not things of earth, I, let's seek to please him, I, and not worry about pleasing man, I, I be called my friend, I, if we please the Lord, I, and, I, and then he will bless us I, along the way, I, and then one day our reward I, will be a home I, in glory land, I, in that heaven, I, I be on the blue I, I sky, I, I where he lives and reigns I, I forevermore, I, and where he sits on the throne of God, I, I listen I, I for you and I, I, and makes intercession, I for you and I towards the Father, I, that we will get home I, one day after a while. Our most kind and gracious Heavenly Father, right? it's again we come to you today, Lord, right? to thank you one more time right? for your love right? and for your mercy right? and for this message you give us tonight. Right? And I pray, Lord, your word right? will not return to you, boy, right? but we accomplish for you sent it. Right? And I pray, Lord, you touch everyone right? with your Holy Spirit again. Right? And Lord, let them know right? how wonderful you are, Lord. Right? And I pray you give us words to say right? that will reach some one, and I pray, O oh Lord, today I for the lost and undone that you send your drawing spirit to them one more time, Lord, and give them the chance to be saved before it's everlasting. I too late because judgment will soon be coming, and it's closer than many think, even at the door, even as we speak. And I pray, O oh Lord, that you reach down to touch those sick and afflicted in body, Lord. If if it be your will, uh, and if it's not your will, Lord, uh, uh, be healed, uh, I pray, Lord, uh, you make their pain and suffering uh, easier to endure, uh, but let their, their faith uh, and righteousness be a witness uh, unto the lost around them, uh, that know they are lost and need a Savior, uh, that they can be one with it through them, uh, to be, come to you and be saved, uh, and Lord, I pray you continue to give us the words uh, that we need to say uh, uh, to the lost and dying world uh, to bring them into you uh, before it's too late uh, and they can be saved uh, and ready to go home uh, when the morning comes. Uh, we know we can't save no one, Lord, uh, but we know you can. Uh, and Lord, I pray uh, you'll save someone tonight uh, before they sleep uh, because tomorrow will not promise, Lord, uh, but eternity is. Uh, and then, Lord, uh, uh, when we get home, uh, uh, we will hear you say, uh, well done, uh, and then we can praise you uh, uh, forevermore uh, uh, while the ages roll on. Uh, not only down here will we praise you, uh, but we'll praise you then uh, uh, forevermore. Uh, but until that day comes, uh, I pray you give us the words uh, that we need to say uh, and lead us on uh, that we may uh, uh, say something uh, that will win someone to you uh, and be saved uh, that they won't have to go down uh, to that lake of fire at uh, uh, Brimstone uh, where the worm dies not, uh, and the fire never quenched, uh, and be one more soul, uh, uh, the devil uh, I can't get, uh, and then Lord, uh, uh, when we get home, uh, we can join those that made it home, uh, and that are waiting for us uh, inside the eastern gate, uh, over there, uh, uh, then we will praise you, uh, and glorify you forevermore, uh, uh, while the ages roll on, uh, because when we get there, uh, there be no more, uh, uh, my Lord, they will be there forever right? and ever. Right? There will be no end. Right? And we've been there 10,000 or 10 million years. Right? There will be no less days right? to praise you then. Right? Right? When we first begun. Right? And the Lord, right? these are the things we pray. Right? And Lord, we glorify you right? Right? forever. Right? These things we pray and ask right? in the wonderful name of our Lord right? and Savior Jesus Christ. Right? Amen. Right? And thank you, Father, one more time. Right? for your love uh, and for your mercy.